Salutations to you out there. We have you have welcome back to my channel. We have another question to solve today. And the question we are solving today is still on the application of the laws of Lord Gary Beam. Now let's go solving this question right now. They are giving a, a question of this nature. Normally, this question is very, very simple and interesting. But the problem we have with this person is just that it's somehow technical, but it's still simple. Just if you can adhere strictly to the laws of log redeem. So we are giving something of this nature. I can have my solution. I don't really have problem with this. I have log 210. I don't have problem with this. But where the problem lies is this particular side. Uh, you can see the base and the power. The base can further be simplified. I can still express this base in terms of this. That is why I should expect because 8 normally is 2 times 2 times 2. And that is 2 raised to power 3. That means this place now we have log 2 raised to power 3. And I also have my power 1 to 5. Then there is a law in, in, in log, with, log with it that we need to consider. Whenever the base is having a power, as if we have something like this log, the base is A, we have B as the power of the base, then we now have C as the power here. This base will surely move to this side. And by moving to that side, it will now become 1 all over B log A C. That means this one now will now be equal to log 2 10. Minus this one we come here. I have one all over three log two one twenty five. You can see what I have here. I can still simplify this further because I now have a coefficient. Then I can still bring this coefficient to this side. If we have a log b c, this a can come here. It now become log b c a. So if I should observe that, I will have log 2 then minus log <coughs> 2 log 2 now we have log 2 here and here now we have 125 raised to power 1 over 3 but 125 is 5 times 5 times 5 which is equivalent to 5 raised to power 3 that means here now i will have log 2 then minus log 2 5 raised to power 3 times 1 over 3. This to be cancelled. So the equation now will now be log 2 then minus log 2 5. As you can see, we have something of this nature. Then we can now observe another law of log. That law of log means this division we change to this minus we change to division. That is again to have log 2, 10, all over 5. As in for this, because the base is common, the log 2, log 2 is common to them. We take that one out. So 5 here is 1, 5 here is 2. That means I'm now going to be left with log 2, 2. And log 2, 2, when the base and power are the same, is always equal to 1. So our answer now will now be equal to 1. we we'll stop here for now. I will take it off from here next time. Thank you for watching. God bless you. Shut up.